trees, the living force of the earth. They exist to give life, oxygen and nutrition. Cars, the living force of the humanity. They exist to give emissions. No, I don't believe that. Do you? Let's see. There is so many cars on the street and they do nothing. Seems we never take into account how precious is this space. Imagine now something better. They become electric plugins. It's a step forward, but we can do even better. Yeah, the electric cars are expensive, no available infrastructure. Are we out of options? Or lack of innovation? Or we just love the old cars? Or none of these? Do you need a new option, an innovation? I don't want the old cars anymore. The solar energy is all around, but is not enough for the cars we used to ride more than a century. But what if the car is so lightweight that do not need too much power? And if you like bicycling, why not do it more often? And if you like sailing, fishing, camping or diving, why not do it whenever you want it and in a more comfortable way? Why not? Maybe because you never had the chance. Now I'm giving you INDE, the most practical personal transportation in the world. It's solar powered. Charge it all of the daytime and ride for free most of the time. It's human power. Shape your body whenever you like. It's amphibian. Make fun wherever you go. It's electric. No emissions and excessive noise. It's lightweight. No use of heavy materials. It's cheap. The smaller the battery, the lower the prices. It's plug-in. Charge it for longer trips. It's independent from elements. A heater for winter, a wiper for rain. It's robust. It has a composite monocoque body. It's safe. As near as a car. It's two-seater. Suitable for 90% of the cases. It's spacious. The front seat is even larger than a mid-class car. And if you really want it, it's yours. Come with me to the shiniest journey of your life. Let's create the new living force of the humanity. Thank you.